Good evening, everybody. Honorable Principal Commissioner Mehta Sir, President Narayan Ko, Sri Niranjan Hiranandaji, Vice President Sri Bandar Kasi, and President Pieta, Mr. Dovans. First of all, I thank Narayan Ko for organizing this knowledge seminar and give me an opportunity to be here. In the just concluded technical session, various chapters in the draft DCR were covered and the presentation given by all the Pieta and Narayan Ko's representative was informative and I am sure it has helped the audience to understand the provisions of DCR. I have been told to talk on DC for two minutes. So I think it's a vast subject. I'll just shortly share a few points about the DP. The entire process of the DP recasting was a teamwork done by our municipal engineers and the urban planners. And most important part of the process was our guidance by our Honorable Municipal Commissioner Sir and OST DP Revision Sri Jha Sir. And there were review meetings under MCSR regarding the process recasting of draft development plan almost every year. Every week we were having those meetings. There were a number of consultation meetings with the representatives of PETA, Naretko and NCHI which helped in preparing the draft DCR and many suggestions were incorporated as per the discussion. But in short, I just want to say the main thrust was given to the three E's in the recasting process and these being the economy, equity and environment. As regards economy, Mumbai being the financial capital of India, provisions are made for creation of additional 10,000 hectares of commercial built-up area in the next 20 years for creating 8 million jobs, which is the employment forecast as per the studies conducted in comprehensive mobility plan. Regarding the equity, we have introduced new reservations, mainly covering the women. There is a multi-purpose hostel for women's care centers, unique electoral wards, other centers, skill centers, vending areas for women, and old age home in each ward. DCR provisions are made for differently able, and further one important provision of affordable housing is also made to make available about 1 million houses at affordable homes. Environment is one of the most important issues nowadays, and some features in this are creation of the new natural areas, about more than 12,000 hectares, where no construction will be allowed. We are provided for buffers along the Nanas, 800 hectares of the RA POS will remain open and this year provisions are made for low construction in garden, playgrounds and the DP has also targeted a high per capita norm for public open space that is more than 4 square meter per person. There are some conceptual changes such as allowing multiple reservations which are compatible on the same plot to utilize full potential of the plot. Then we have accommodation reservation policies for non-buildable reservations that is also introduced and to improve the quality of life provisions are made for leisure parks, art and culture reservations in addition to the health, education and social requirement. In the presentation there were some suggestions regarding the draft this year. I request that we are accepting suggestions and objections on draft this year. DP as well as draft DCR till 29 July 2016 and anyone can submit this suggestion objection either in the form of hard copy at the special counter opened by us at the ground floor of municipal head office or it can be submitted online on by going through the portal MCGM by clicking on the link of draft DP 2014-34 suggestion objections. And I take this opportunity to thank everyone who has participated in this process and thank you very much.